matter. Because black lives matter. Black lives matter. We are here tonight. We are here tonight. Because all these people, all these people, are going about their commute. Are going about their commute. And doing a very bad job. And doing a very bad job. At social distancing. At social distancing. Black people. Black people are still dying. Are still dying. At the hands of the police. At the hands of the police. And at the hands of white supremacists. And at the hands of white supremacists. All across this country. All across this country. All across this earth. All across this earth. We are here tonight. We are here tonight. For Daniel Prude. For Daniel Prude. I will now tell you some facts about Daniel Prude and why we are here tonight. Fact one. Daniel Prude was a 41-year-old black man from Chicago. He was close with his brother Joe. Around 3 a.m., Joe called 911 for help when Daniel took off his clothes and ran outside into the snow. When the police arrived, they threatened Joe with arrest if he tried to help search for Daniel. Fact 3. Officer Troy Talladay used his knee to pin Daniel's naked body to the freezing ground. Officer Mark Vaughn then pushed Daniel's head into the pavement for three minutes, killing him. Fact 4. said the officers' actions were consistent with their training. No one has been charged with any crime in the murder of Daniel Prude. This is not an isolated incident. The NYPD have killed over 300 people since the murder of Amadou Diallo. Over 80% of those they kill are black or brown, mostly unarmed, and committed no crime. We are here tonight for Daniel Prude. We are here tonight for 